Good morning, my lovelies. Hi. I am actually not usually up this early. It's about 7 o'clock. I usually go to bed really late because I'm editing, but I couldn't sleep. And after my eight-week hive check that I did yesterday, I was concerned that my girls are about to swarm. So I should backtrack a little bit and talk a bit about swarming. And swarming is when the colony gets to a certain size that they're ready to reproduce and divide. So half of the colony with the old queen leaves the old colony to establish a new colony. So normally this is not typical behavior of a new package or a first year hive, which I have, because their numbers are relatively small. But we've had such a wet and rainy spring here in New England, the theory is that they've been cramped and stuck inside all this time. They get this feeling that they're cramped and that they need to leave the hive and, you know, make a new home. I believe it was the fifth wettest spring on record. And even though I added another brew box on top, the girls still felt cramped, even though their situation wasn't. So I'm going to try to remedy the situation and prevent them from swarming because I want to keep them here. <laughs> and I'm going to bring a couple frames of brew from down below up top to encourage them to build up in the top box. And this is called pyramiding. And then I'm going to stagger the bottom brew box with some empty frames to encourage them to build that out. Fingers crossed. We'll see. I'm glad that I caught this relatively early, but I hope I can prevent them from swarming. Usually when they get their swarm on, they're gone. So, we'll see. <laughs> So we're going to take these empty foundation frames and stagger them in between the brew chamber. Oops. Empty frame again. We're going to move two of these frames, brew frames, up into the middle. Let's see. I'm sorry, sweetie. This is a very solid brood pattern, about filled with some nectar. So I'm going to move this one up along with I'll bring three frames up, I think. This frame looks really good. frames up and then put these four frames in between those frames, right? Alright. So now we're going to lift one of these up to the next frame. So I have one, two, three new frames up there. Push, bring a fourth one up.
so we've moved brood chamber up. And add a couple frames into here. So this has one, two new frames. Finally, I'm going to give them some extra pollen. done. All right, so I just pyramided the bees. I hope that keeps them here. I've really become attached. I know I shouldn't. They're livestock, but you know, I've only had them for eight weeks and I'd really like them to, you know, stick around. So I'll check again in a week and see what they've done. Hopefully they've built out more comb for brood rather than just for nectar, but we'll see. Fingers crossed. All right, see you next time. Bye.